The theme for this year's conference is Love One Another, the Importance of Christian Love in Healthcare. And um, I picked that partially as a defense mechanism because of the wide group that I've got in the room. But more seriously, um, just from that passage in John 13 where Jesus says, By this everyone will know that you are my disciples if you have love for one another. A friend once said, This is precisely how we shall be recognized as Christians. If we take charity as the starting point of everything we do, Christ, who is purity personified, did not declare to his apostles, you will be known because you are not gluttons or drunkards. Yet again, Christ, who is so humble, does not state, you will be known as my disciples by your modesty and humility. Jesus stresses once and for all, by this you will be known, by the love you have for one another. As physicians, we are called to love our patients, our colleagues, and the communities in which we practice. We are entering a time when matters of conscience and defending the sanctity of life are of critical importance. From the book of Esther, yet who knows whether you haven't come to the kingdom for such a time as this. Sorry. We have all been called to called for a time as this, and on the behalf of the planning committee, we hope this conference you will be equipped to serve and love um, in this challenging time. So um, I'm just going to quote from another passage here in John 12. Jesus reminds us that when he is lifted up from the earth, he will draw all people to himself. And uh, the, my favorite philosopher from Boston, Peter Kraft, has said in reference to this that God has a certain spiritual gravity in drawing us to himself. And I see us coming together at this conference as part of that spiritual gravity where God's drawing us to himself together. In Kreef's words, thus all spiritual gravity, including ecumenical gravity, is through Christ. All return, all home homecoming, all reconciliation, all mutual understanding, all healing of the wounds in the body of Christ is through the gravity of the grace of the body of Christ. Christ is the golden key to all history and therefore to future ecumenism. So I want to thank you all for joining us for this conference to reflect on what we are being called to right now, to a vocation of love and medicine drawn by our mutual love for the Lord. Throughout the conference, there may be certain sessions that appeal to you and others that don't, and you're welcome at any session that interests you this weekend.